hey guys welcome back so in today's video i'm going to do a watercolor painting instead of uh, vector art so have a look so now i'm going to test using a huge document which is an a1 size i tried a0 there is a bit of lag so i tried this a1 size that seems to be okay now i've been thinking about comparing affinity designer with procreate in terms of uh, putting out a watercolor art so i'm still undecided on this which one is better i think i need a few more tries before i make a video comparing the the two of them so far i've only painted single objects for example the fox so if you looked up if you looked up my video playlist you can actually see I painted a fox in uh, using Affinity Designer's brushes, watercolor brushes. I find that uh, they work very very well. So in this video I'm gonna do a flamingo and I think it turns out quite good actually. I haven't tried painting a scenery yet, a full background scenery with skies and and hills and mountains and the forest and all that. I think um, one day I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna paint a scenery. That'll be in future videos. Anyway, for now, I think I'm gonna stop talking now and let you watch the whole video in peace.
like this video please give it a thumbs up if you want to see more of this kind of videos do consider to subscribe because i will be posting more of this kinds of video for affinity designer as well as uh, other apps that i really really find very useful in doing my kind of artwork that i like